Hey there, it's Kaylee. This lesson is on fact families and using a multiplication chart as a tool. This is a multiplication chart. The numbers that go down tell us how the row is growing. By twos, like two, four, six, eight, ten, and so on. And the numbers across the top tell us how the columns are growing, like by tens, 10, 20, 30, 40, and so on. We use it like this. Say I need to calculate three times six. I can find three on the side and six on the top. Where those two lines intersect is the answer. Three times six is 18. I can also use my multiplication chart to divide. Let's say I have 35 divided by seven. Well, first I find my divisor on the side, seven. And then I go across until I find 35, right here. And now I go straight up. Whatever number is at the top is my answer, five. So 35 divided by seven is five. Now let's focus on our twos. It will be helpful if you know how to skip count or count by twos like two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Now let's use our multiplication chart to learn about fact families. I need to find two times three. So the first thing I do is find two over on the side here. And then I just highlight across. Then I find three up on the top and I highlight down. And where those two lines intersect is my answer, six. Now what if I needed to find three times two? Well, the first thing I'm gonna do is find three over here on the side and I'm gonna highlight across. Then I'm gonna find two up here at the top and I'm gonna highlight down. And where those two pink lines intersect is my answer, which is also six. So this tells me that two times three and three times two are a fact family. A fact family is when all the numbers are the same in different math facts. Now, what if I needed to find six divided by two. Well, I'm gonna take my divisor here two. I'm gonna find it over here on the side of my chart. And then I highlight over until I find my dividend, which is six. From six, I go straight up, and whatever number is up at the top is my answer, three. So notice that these numbers in this equation are also six, two, and three. So I can add this to my fact family that was two times three equals six and three times two equals six. Now, what do you think will happen if I have six divided by three? First, I take my divisor here. I find it over on the side of my chart. I'm gonna highlight over until I find my dividend. Right there is six. And then I go straight up and I have my answer right there at the top. Two. And how lucky are we? This equation also has the numbers six, three, and two. So it looks like this equation can also join into our fact family here. So all four of these equations are a fact family for two, three, and six. If you can learn one math fact, you can figure out all four facts in the family. Let's look at the example of four times five equals 20. Since I know this fact, I know that I can switch around my factors. So five times four is also 20, and in my fact family, since the three numbers are all the same. 
Now, if I know the multiplication facts, I can deduct the division facts. I can take the product of my multiplication and divide it by one of my factors to get the other, like 20 divided by four is five. And if that is true, then I know I can say 20 divided by five is four. And now I have an entire fact family. So let's do a trickier one together. I'm gonna to find the fact family with the numbers that include nine and six. So let's figure out what nine times six is using our multiplication chart. Remember I come over here and I find nine on the side and then I highlight all the way across. Then I find six up on the top and I highlight all the way down and where my pink lines intersect is my answer, which is right there, 54. So since I know that this already is a math fact, I can switch around my factors so I know six times nine is also equal to 54. And since these three numbers are all the same, I know that that's a fact family. Now let's do a division problem. What if I needed to know 54 divided by, oops, 54 divided by nine? So remember what I can do is I take my divisor here, I find it over here on the side. I highlight across until I find the number 54 and then I go straight up and I get my answer, which is six. Which knowing that these numbers form a fact family, nine, six, and 54, we could have deducted that. So that means we can also say 54 divided by six is equal to nine. Nice, so now we've found another fact family. And now you get to try. Use your multiplication table to find the fact families for one through 12. Practice what you've learned by playing our online games and quizzes. Have fun and remember to always be clever. Hey.